you do understand if you get hurt screwing around with Julius, Izzo's going to kill you. They ain't going to kill both you, of them. It, it, what happened last March is not even going to look like anything like he's going to do. Yeah, that's going to be 2.0, whatever he is. <laughs> Aaron, you, you and Cassius both, after the loss in the Final Four, said something in the locker room that really shocked me. When you said, we wasn't good enough, got to get better. Absolutely. And I, t I talked to Cash earlier tonight about it. I want to ask you, so what have you done to get better? Just increase the way I work. You know, I changed. I feel like I changed my body even more than what it was last last year. Improving my game. I've been, obviously, my shot and my ball handling and stuff like that. And, you know, just, just improving my, my total game and just improving how hard I work. Do you feel more aggressive with your offense right now? Absolutely, I do. Uh, coaches expect expects me to have a bigger role this year, and you know, I have to step up and be one of the players to maybe provide some this year. And we got a lot of pieces this year on and off the bench. So, I mean, I'm just excited to be a part of it. Coming off a Final Four loss, is your appetite even stronger this year than it was last year when maybe you didn't know what to expect? Absolutely. Not knowing what to expect last year, was, was, it was everything was new. So, I mean, now that I've been here, I got my first day, especially as a freshman that's huge, however, my, however long I'm here. I mean, I just plan to give it all every time and not, not stop until I get a national championship, even if I do it in. You've, uh, you were there last year. What do you pass on to those? to Malik and, and to Julius? Uh, just knowing that the steps that it took last year when it started in the summer, the, the fall, you know, all the way up to the winter and the spring, and just times in that by two, because, you know, what we did last year just wasn't good enough, and all the games that we won during the regular season and the championships, the Big Ten stuff, I mean, it was huge for this program, but at a national standpoint, I mean, we beat some teams in the tournament, but we, we didn't finish the job, and this year I feel like we can. Is you sliding to the four at all next year? Is that something that's been talked about, a possibility? Uh, I mean, I haven't heard from it, but I mean, I've, I've played a little four in my career, especially in high school, so I mean, I can, something I definitely can do. You know, I know I play that spot pretty well, but anything coach wants me to come find me. How versatile can this team be? I mean, you've got guys that can switch and move different spots. Absolutely. I mean, very, very tough to, to score on, I feel like, defensively, and, and tough to, to, to match up with you know, deep people are guarding us. So, I mean, this team that has a lot of potential, but we got a long way to go. we got a long way to go. How much have you focused on just your jump shot? Uh, just a lot, you know, just every day, 7 a.m. I'm, I'm working with Chris and just, just getting better on that. And it's just not a matter of just me not being able to shoot. It's just, just my confidence and everything. Just, just seeing the ball go to the basket. Just, I'm past it already, so, I mean, it's, it'll, it'll show. We haven't really talked to you in a while, but when did you find out that Cash was going to come back? Uh, I mean, it was... I mean, we talk a lot. We're close. I mean, so I mean, it was it was a decision that I knew pretty early. But he just didn't want to make it public till whenever. He didn't really ever consider. At least is what I was told. It was just something he just wanted to be here. Yeah. So I mean, that, that's just him though. Just wanted to be around the guys. Obviously, I think he could have left and did well for himself. But just wanted to come back and just and just him being cash is just who he is. Hmm. Last question from me, Aaron. But you have played here now for a year, but you come into the season with a preseason number one ranking. <laughs> Do you like, Izzo likes the bullseye on the chest. Yeah. Do you like that? Because from day one now, everyone's gunning for you. Yeah, we're going to get everybody's best game, number one or not, just because we're Michigan State. But I mean, that just that just, just raises the bar for us. And it just makes us stay on our toes at all the times. So and just know we got to play out our best, too. And that's just going to prepare us longer and longer for this, the stuff that we need to do in March. Thank you. Thank you.